Right. Oh, time to make 2020 map. <laughs> Hello everyone. Before we start, I would just like to say yes, the smoothie that I'm drinking does look like actual sh <laughs> Um, Like it's legit brown, but it tastes really good and that's all that matters, you know? <sighs> anyway, I am here today to tell you that I am giving less f in 2020. This is just a video to update you guys on this account and also my Kawhi JPEG Instagram account. Does anyone really care? No, I don't think so. But I kind of wanted to preface this channel starting over again with an update just for my, just for organization's sake. I don't know. I just wanted to do it. Um, but basically I have realized that I am making myself miserable. I have an online shop I have five Instagram accounts, I have two YouTube channels, I have a full-time job, and I'm writing a book this year. There is no time for me to get pernickety and cause myself stress in any of those situations where I don't have to. That didn't make any sense. Basically what I'm trying to say is that my Kawaii JPEG Instagram account was only ever meant to be like a little side thing that made me happy and it was taking photos. Yes, it started and it was gonna be a lot of, and it was a lot of work and is a lot of work because I started like all pink and pretty and happy and I was like, this is great. And then it got to a point where I was like, I can't sustain these photos. They take too long to shoot and edit. And then I was like, you know what, I'll make it rainbow because that means I've got more choice, more colours, more things to do, you know, we'll add in a bit of white here. And that's generally like how I, th how I think, like that sounds ridiculous to any normal person who's not creative, like why? Well, like going from pink to rainbow is such a big deal. But like aesthetically, I feel like a lot of people watching will understand that like Instagram and aesthetics and the way the feed looks is important to people. You know, I am a creative, I am a content creator by hobby, but also by career. So I do it within an agency for other brands. So I have picked up some seriously anal tendencies um, when it comes to like, well not even, I haven't picked them up, but it's, it's me. Like if there's white in my picture, like it has to be like pure white. It can't be like a yellowy creamy color. I hate it. Even though things in pictures are never pure white. Like things in, in real life aren't pure white. Like that's the one, and that's like a number one rule for photography. Like things aren't pure white because you can't get pure white in real, like, do you know? Anyway, so anyway, I realized with that and other things like it all having to be rainbow and then I can't post anything that has brown in it because God forbid brown isn't cute like this, even just having the wood in my flat showing in this video is stressing me out, but it's ridiculous. Life is too short. 2020 is gonna be the year for just getting stuff done, letting things go. And that's what I'm here to tell you is that this channel is gonna be starting again. Not that it really started in the first place. Um, and I'm gonna be posting whatever the hell I want on here, to be honest. I'm literally planning everything from January favorites to thrift with me's uh, to you know, everything from those to everything I hated about the last Star Wars film. Do I care if people watch it? A tiny bit, not gonna lie. But at the same time, this was this YouTube channel and the Instagram account were only ever meant to be hobbies. And I really want to go into this new year and just post things that I wanna post that maybe aren't like the most beautifully crafted pictures, but they're bright and colorful and rainbow and they make me happy. So I've sort of started posting those kind of photo, you know, casual, more casual, casual, casual. <laughs> more casual photos on my Instagram and it's just been like a weight off my shoulders. Yes, it still upsets me. Yes, I would still like to do some really high quality pictures and I am still having to stick to that with my shop account. Um, but I just want I just want there to be less stress. There shouldn't be this much stress involved in two things that are meant to be hobbies. So as I said, I'm gonna be posting whatever I want on there, whatever I want on here. And I really just wanna focus on the editing, getting my skills better with my videos. Um, I'm self-taught, have been since 13, and it's also my job. And I've just gotten to a point where like, I'm, I'm a great video editor, I would have thought, um, but I'm just, I need to inject something new into it. So basically I just want to practice my animations and my graphics and my looks and feels and getting videos, you know, um, editing videos differently for different um, themes. And yeah, anyway, let's not go there. I'm not giving you like a game plan. I, again, the tendency to be a bit anal about things is proven by this video because you didn't need an update video, but in my head to organize my things in, you know, I needed to have a update video. So things aren't going to be changing too much. I'm still me. But at the same time, I just want to be a bit freer with my content and make whatever I want and not stress about colours and themes and 
will people like it and you know which I suppose has been spurred on by the the likes disappearing on Instagram like I don't I never thought I cared too much and I don't necessarily but it's more like it doesn't matter if no one likes it no one's gonna see it like I don't even see it so it, you know I just I like that way of thinking for 2020 just going forwards like you know what if they make a video and no one watches it I don't care I just want to make a video about talk about Star Wars if people watch it great if they don't I really don't care so yeah, are the uploads going to be regular? God knows. I just don't know. I don't know what's going to happen, but I just wanted to update you guys. And also like, if you're also feeling the same way and you're a blogger or an influencer, obviously it's different. I'm not trying to make any money. I'm not trying to get any sponsorships. There's, you know, not everyone will just be able to be like, yeah, screw it. I'm going to post whatever I want. But it's just a more positive way of looking at things for me this year. And 2020, as I said at the beginning, has got a lot of stuff going on in it. And I just need to minimise clutter in all aspects of my life. Brain, flat, food. Hence why I'm drinking a smoothie that's got freaking pumpkin seeds in it. Anyway, so that is the video. <laughs> if you see me in an upcoming video looking exactly the same, it's because I filmed it straight after this one. And why would I get changed? Because I'm trying to care less about aesthetics. Like there are no lights up right now. I would usually have my studio lights up. I'd I'd have gotten rid of all the brown. You know, you've got your photo lights. Um, but yeah, and I'm feeling a weight lifted off my shoulders. You know, I would love to keep it up the way it was, but I can't. I just cannot in a studio flat put up my studio lights every single time I want to say something to a camera. It's just not going to happen. So yeah, you'll probably see me in exactly the same wears um in an upcoming video which hopefully is going to come god knows i don't know so yeah that's the video if you stick around if you're st if you're still here from the beginning of this channel welcome if you don't like that plan i'm um, if you're new and you like me and my face and my plans sort of that i've told you about subscribe yeah that's about it <laughs> well that went well right <laughs>